Hi, my name is Eric Wilson. I'm an independent licensed mechanic with 35 years of service, and I've um, been contracted by Waheed Auto Sales in Lethbridge to give you the inside story. Well, in the next five to six minutes, I'm going to do exactly that so you can make an informed decision whether this is for you or not. Okay, starting off in the left front tire, your tread is about 60%, about 60%, and your strut is dirty but dry which is important spring is intact your sway bar link from here down to there that is intact and again that's that's what keeps the sway half from happening this is your outer tie rod this is very critical to be strong and i'm going to check that in a minute your uh, the, your outer CV boot is uh, not ripped and you can see just inside there your inner CV boot is not ripped or broken which is a good sign. Just a quick perusal under the motor there's no visible oil leaks that I can see. Okay on your your rotors and they're not new but they are very clean and brakes you've got about uh, I'm gonna say like about 30,000 K uh, left on the front. Now your outer tie rod is good and tight and again that's critical. Okay so your your outer CV on the right is intact. Your inner CV, a little hard to see there, it's covered in grease but it's not ripped that I can see. Uh, your Steer it. Now your outer tie rod on the right is here and I'm going to check that in a moment. Your strut is good and dry. Your tires again about the same. About 30,000 K left I, I'd imagine on your front right. Okay and your strut just a quick shot. Again, good and dry which is important because this is where any oil would be leaking if that's the case. On your rotor your rotors are, they're not new, but again, they are clean. And again, about 30,000 K on the front brakes. Okay, coming in on the, the the rear left, this tire is pretty much worn out. I'd definitely be negotiating a set of at least rear tires. Your shock is dry, your spring is intact, your sway bar link is good, uh, no visible leaks there. Your, Inner, your inner uh, CV boot on the left side is is intact. Your outer CV boot is intact on the rear left. Okay, your rotor is again not new, but it is good and clean. Your brakes have got about, I'd say about 30, 20, about 25,000 K left on the rear behind the rear brakes. Okay, this this rear tire again worn out. You need to get another set, negotiate a set of uh, rear brakes, or uh, rear pads, okay, rear tires, get it right. Okay, your spring is here, which is intact, your shock is intact, uh, and no visible leaks on your brake system here, which is a good thing. Your outer, right outer CV is intact, and your, you can see inside there, the left inner, no, the right inner, um, CV boot is intact. Okay, rotors again clean, brakes about 25,000 K for the back brakes. Now on my scan, uh, it's a little hard to see because of the glare, but there is no codes on any of the systems of this vehicle. Okay, oil is decently clean and up to where it needs to be and the thing I always check on any motor is to see if there's any white goo under the oil cap. And this, there is no white goo that I can see, which is a good sign because uh, that would mean an internal leak and there is none that I can see. And I'm not surprised, these are pretty low, these are, these are very low cake. Okay, so a quick perusal of the motor and now I'm gonna do what is called the, the water test glass of water on the motor and you can see just how rough or smooth it is by the glass of water.